An assurance tonight that Singapore is ready to go the distance in creating climate change solutions as the fight shifts from the why to the how. Senior Minister Teo Chi Hien says the country will share revised plans to achieve net zero goals by 2050 later this year. He says government policy is one key pathway to this climate ambition. Another is private sector initiatives. Mr Teo has been speaking at an event on so-called eco-sparity. To remain competitive in the long term, businesses need to incorporate decarbonisation and climate risks into their strategies. As demand for sustainable practices increase, first movers will capture upsides while laggards may be written off as doing too little too late. The three-day event at Marina Bay Sands is hosted by state investor Tamasic. It focuses on solutions to decarbonise emissions-intensive sectors such as transport and finance the green transition. Activities will also be happening on the sidelines. These include a, a key announcement by the Glasgow Financial Alliance for Net Zero, better known as GFANZ, and the convening of the Civil Aviation Authority of Singapore's International Advisory Panel that will look at sustainable air hubs. Carbon market events will also feature prominently.